Hello and welcome to Wonderland. It is a beautiful sunny afternoon and it's June. So, oh my goodness, sun in June is always a blessing here. We are going to have afternoon tea at the Conrad in the Orchid Room today. So come along with me and let's see what we get up to. Hello and welcome back to Wonderland. We are inside the Orchard Room at the Conrad St. James. I'm really looking forward to this tea. I've been waiting for a long time to finally get here. Now it's time for some important information for your afternoon tea at the Conrad St. James. Afternoon tea at the Conrad St. James is served Monday through Sunday, 12 to 5. Last orders are 4 p.m. The closest tube stop is going to be St. James Park on the Circle or District Line. Traditional afternoon tea starts at 60 pounds per person. If you'd like a glass of Bollinger Champagne, that'll be 15 pounds per glass. Personally, I feel the best still is bottomless Bollinger Champagne at 95 pounds a person for an hour and 30 minutes. I made my reservations with my favorite booking service, AfternoonTea.co.uk. And finally, the dress code at the Conrad St. James is Smart Casual. I have my glass of Bollinger and I'm looking forward to trying this. Nice and bubbly. So the only thing that lets me down is when I see a glass that's that full because I'm thinking, I want it up to here if it's a glass of, of champagne, but they must be uh, told how far you can lift it up or fill it up, so here we are. Let's see, I've been given an afternoon tea menu for all the different kinds of teas. There's different herbal teas, green teas, white tea, oolong tea, and yeah, it looks good. I'm gonna go for Earl Grey. I love Earl Grey, it makes me happy, it's all good. I have the menu now for my royal tea, and I'll just go through it really quick. We've got our finger sandwiches, oak smoked Scottish salmon with cream cheese and chive, coronation chicken with baby Jim lettuce, Wilshire ham with cheddar and right royal pickle, truffled, uh -huh, truffle, truffled egg mayonnaise with watercress, looking forward to that, and a cucumber and white pepper with mint. I've had it with mint before and it is so delicious. And then we move on to our cakes and pastries. We have a gilded lemon and verbena meringue tart. Ooh, like lemon, very nice and tart. A Duke of Earl Grey tea infused chocolate and hazelnut uh, crown. Mm. English strawberry and Cotswold elderflower gin roulade. Ooh. And a blackcurrant estate dairy yogurt show bun. They all sound beautiful. And then of course we get plain and fruit scones accompanied with ah, lemon curd, strawberry compote, and Devonshire clotted cream. Sounds like a perfect meal. I love it, I already love it. I haven't even tried anything, but I already love it. So this is promising to be a very good tea, I think. Service already has been very quick and efficient and very friendly here at the Orchard Room at the Conrad St. James. I've got my Earl Grey tea here. It smells delightful. What kind of tea is your favorite? Definitely, I love an Earl Grey, especially for afternoon time. Can't beat it. Got my little strainer right there. Very nice, loose leaf tea. Here's my cute little teapot. And I've got a little bit of cream and I've got sugar way back there. So perfect, I'm going to enjoy this now. It's 
so delicious. I just like it plain. It's just perfect. This is probably the best coronation chicken I've ever had. If you'd like another uh, sandwich, they'll bring one to you. They said, you know, don't go crazy, but how can you go crazy when you've got all of this in front of you, right? A whole tea tower worth of goods. So that's nice to know because some places won't let you have another little sandwich if you want one, but most places will. And I wanted to make sure to let you know they will do it here. Fill your boots. I think that's what they call it. Fill your boots. Because I am alone in my tea room, I'm going to do this. Oops, <laughs> part of my crown fell off. Isn't this just lovely? Look at that. Oh, oh my goodness. Yum. This looks really beautiful. I'm looking forward to this. Look at my little crown. See, I can do this. I'm alone, right? I'm here for you. Don't do this. I'm doing it so you don't have to. <laughs> so let me tell you, we have a tie for first place. It is that chocolate crown and the gilded lemon. I don't know which I would choose over the other. This chocolate is so rich and beautiful, yet the crown itself is so not rich. It's just, it's a hint of chocolate, but it's not hard. You bite it and it just crumbles beautifully. Oh my gosh, lovely dessert. I am so incredibly, incredibly thrilled with ending on this dessert. Absolutely wonderful afternoon tea so far. It is just so wonderful to take afternoon tea. So when you're in London or anywhere else in the UK, heck, anywhere in your home country, have your afternoon tea. It is worth it. It is just such a, just a lovely thing to do in the afternoon. I wanted to tell you, yes, I would definitely come back to the Conrad Hotel in St. James for their afternoon tea at the Orchard Room. Great time, lovely service, food was fantastic. All of the savories were fresh and just made just for me. The uh, desserts were lovely, the scones were perfect. Yeah, atmosphere, very easy going. Thank you so much for watching today. Thank you for following me down in Wonderland once again for afternoon tea. Please like and subscribe and I really do enjoy making this content for you. So tell your friends because I want to keep doing this for you. So I'll see you next time in Wonderland. Bye-bye.